Hey guys, uh, Nick Tian here. Welcome back to... Well, not welcome back. This is a new series of Let's Play uh, What Remains of Edith Finch. I'm going to be playing this game uh, starting from today. Uh, re kind of taking over the slot that... Uh, what was that again that I played? Wow. Just played it yesterday and I can't remember. Uh, Donut County. So what remains of Edith Finch? Uh, it's kind of a game that I'm actually quite interested in playing because uh story-based game, I guess. So, I guess why is the okay? I haven't gone through the thing yet. And I'm sorry about that. I'm just going to start at the beginning with the house. Okay. Uh the frame rate is a bit weird, so let me go into Okay, apparently I can't do anything with this. Camera controls inverted. That's pretty much it. Alright, so I guess... Whatever this motion blur thing that's going on is going to be the case. And uh, hopefully there is a little bit of subtitles. Okay. So I won't have to be too worried about talking over this. But I wasn't allowed inside half the rooms. Can she run? Inside the mailbox, the bill is from seven years ago. Marked urgent. Open immediately. No yeah, trespassing. My brother Lewis is here. Oop. No trespassing. This property is protected by. Resolution is a bit low, though. Like that, that font there wasn't exactly clear. Hello? I'm not sure. Is it a problem with? Uh, the PS4 Pro? Or is it just what it is? Okay. Okay. Which way should I go first? Left or right? Let's go right, uh, left. So I played uh, Vanishing of Ethan Carter. So th these kind of games I'm actually quite interested in. Like for example, Vanishing of Ethan Carter. Like what I said. Uh, Dear Esther. So I'm actually, uh, yeah, quite interested to see what they could do with uh, games like this, like story-based games that, that you control in first person. Gone Home, I should actually let's play that someday. Because not, I, I don't feel that every single game has to be like shooty-shooty action games, so if something like this, which tells a good story, I, I, I don't mind. Actually, I would appreciate it more, actually. Yeah, taking a chance to do something different uh, versus uh, something that's pretty much done already. I, I also have the witness as well, so that's also another one that is kind of... Well, I wouldn't say it's a similar vein, but it's still a first-person game with puzzle mechanics or story base. The house was exactly like I remember it, the way I'd been dreaming. Okay, cool. I guess we walk up the steps and I didn't expect that path to actually lead back there. As a child, the house made me uncomfortable in a way I uh, there's a, words. I guess there's a timer related to how often the text comes in. Cuz uh, you automatically face you know, that direction. Which is kind of smart actually. Exactly. Those words were I was afraid of that. We can't interact with everything, right? Not not like Gone Home, which you can play around with the stuff and check I it out. The key might unlock the front door. It didn't. Okay. Looking in, I felt like the house itself had been waiting for me. Yeah, the motion blur is a bit weird. Hope it's just me that I feels that it's, it's like a, a little bit slow. Oh, 
There's a wind chime. I was wondering, is that is that music or is it just uh, something that's happening on the side? Crawling through the doggy door used to be a lot easier when I was 11. Okay. So it's auto checkpoints uh, saving. Okay, so I don't have to manually save, I suppose. That's a uh, really cute small swimming pool. Lights. The power had been turned off the night we left. They never turned back on. For the first time in January 2010, Edith. Edith, Milton, Lewis, Don, Edie. Edith is the character I'm playing as. Oh, I missed the door. I felt like I was home. That's a lot of things to look at. But instead of a family, there were just memories of one. Yeah, I think she's Edith. Mom is Dawn, Louis, Edie. Edie is the grandmother. Okay. Louis Finch, beloved brother to Edith, son of Dawn, great grandson of Edie. Memory memorial service. Okay, so Louis is the one who died. So I guess the question is, how did he die? Uh, the holiday feast, Mitch's kitchen, Witch's kitchen, sorry, Viking's belly. Tasting Thailand, Nordic cook. Oh, these are our cookbooks. Flour, salt, water, yeast. Northwest Chef. Okay, that's a lot of plates actually. Like how only one restaurant would deliver to our house, so we had Chinese a lot. Okay, Imperial Palace. Good service then. Or how after Lewis started working at the cannery, we all got sick of eating salmon, except our cat. Molly. Free food. Recipe for apple pie. Let's head to the back first. Wow, these locations are really. The was still a wreck from the night we left. Why did they leave? It was like a bomb had gone off, killing everyone but sparing the furniture. Grandmother's wheelchair is there. How did she leave without the wheelchair? My mom was the only one of us who could imagine Great Grandma Edie living in a nursing home. Hmm. Okay. That's a half-built brick wall there. Oh no, it's a chimney. Okay. Nothing in the house looked abnormal. There was just. Yeah, that's a lot of stuff. There's a lot of books. Even the fireplace had a story. Edie told me the bricks came from the original house after it sank. Huh. Okay, well, that's cool. The text just went through. Finch, so his great grandmother. Since the mom is Dawn, right? This door is sealed. Wow, why are there so many books? A lot of things got left behind in the whirlwind last night. Okay, door is still locked, I guess. My mom wasn't much of an optimist, but she never stopped believing that my brother Milton was alive. Oh, okay. So, Lewis died somehow, Milton disappeared. So Edith is the one that has to look for what's going on here? And yet this, the, the game's name is called What Happened to Edith Finch. So, something mom happened to her? told me to stay out of the basement, so I wasn't too surprised when the key didn't. Okay, so upstairs, I suppose. There are a lot of books. After Milton disappeared, 
Mom sealed up all the bedrooms. Then Edie retaliated and drilled peep holes. Yeah, why is she sealing the rooms that way? Edie's father Odin built the original house. Barbara, okay. 1944 to 1960. Is this like, uh, how would I put it? Uh, wow, there's another story, okay. Whenever people ask me about my family, the first thing they always want to know about is Barbara. Okay, so I guess one of the family members is a famous actress. Edie, 1917 to 2010. So she stayed in great grandfather's house, a uh, room. Gregory. So this is about the Finch family then. Oh, right, there is a family tree, right? Upstairs, I guess. Whew, that's a lot of books. Well, at least the book titles are clear enough to be read, right? Mom must have locked the four stairs on the night we left. Okay, so where does the key actually work? room it's not sealed uh, but I can't get in oh okay the last time I was in Edith senior's room oh Edith senior I was 10 when she was painting my portrait okay so you can actually come up to the door and look at the peepholes wow as a kid I just assumed every house had peepholes and sealed rooms you weren't allowed inside of that's so weird. Okay. Calvin. My grandpa Sam spent seven years sharing a room with his dead brother. Calvin. Sharing a room with his dead brother. Oh, okay. I read that as the brother's already dead and sharing a room that he's still in. Wow. Barbara was a child star for two years until America grew out of it. Okay, child star. Still have no idea where the key actually used. Uh, oh, ooh, okay, this door is open. Uh, let's look at this one first. Who is this? Molly. Molly always seemed like a girl I could imagine being friends with if she hadn't died in 1947. Okay. There's no name on this door. I spent a lot of time playing in Great Uncle Walter's room. I think my mom sometimes regretted not sealing it up. Is there something that happens in this room? Lewis told me there were secret passages, but I never believed him. 20,000 leagues under the sea. So I guess, okay. Turns out, my mom was really good at keeping secrets. Oh wow, okay. Uh, pull up. Now it was time to find out what my mom had been afraid of. Oh, dear, with a house like this, I will be afraid. But saying that, I kind of wish I had a big house like this as well. Staying in condominiums and stuff like that for most of my life. I kind of wish I was back hometown where I was staying in a house again. But I had no idea what was behind that door. Whose room is this? She seems short. No idea whatsoever. Molly. 
Are those shrines? I got the sense Edie had spent a lot of time here before my mom sealed the doors. Daddy, that's a uh, sea serpent, Molly in the building, underwater. Okay. Pacific Ocean chart. Guess this person liked uh, sea life a lot. And the house map is there, right? That looks like a house map. Scorpions, a clock. December 13, 1947. Dear Diary, I'll be gone soon, but I wanted to tell somebody. Seems like there's a. Uh, mystery that happens like I'm not mistaken like all all of the finches have some like uh, story about how they died oh wow why 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 is she eating it so weird my Halloween candy was all gone hmm Still feels a bit weird. Some of these rooms are like left as is or as as it was. Untouched at all. Okay. I kept eating and eating. Ooh. Is that something that she's supposed to eat? I ate a lot of things that night. Is that why she got sick? I don't think she's supposed to eat some of these things. Then I heard chirping outside my window. It was a barn swallow going back to her nest. I reached out for her. And she fell? And suddenly... Oh, she became a cat. Okay. I was a cat. That scared me. I tried to be quiet. Bird was really scared. Oop. Okay, at least it's automatic jumping. Mom and Dad didn't even look at you. Hmm. Well, that's a nice way of doing a platformer, actually. Just follow the lights and the bird. I jumped and I almost got her. I could tell she was getting really tired. Where is she? Over there. And she fell off. And suddenly, I was an owl. First, all I heard was the wind. Then I heard little teeth nibbling in the grass. Okay. Is it? I don't know. I don't see anything yet. I don't see any. <laughs> oh, there. Okay. Huh. I imagine his face looking up. Ugh. First person. Okay. Owl eating. Something bigger. I would think a rabbit is quite big actually for an owl. A mama rabbit. Okay, mama rabbit, here I come. He's 
Oh, she was almost too big to carry. Why is it at first? And I hear heartbeats. Suddenly, I was a shark. Okay. Ugh. <laughs> uh. Oh, stuck. Okay. Yeah. R one is. Uh, the trigger button is to hop around. I guess gotta roll all the way back down to the river or sea. Or the ocean. Hey, oh, whoa. I rolled off a cliff and into the ocean. Now I was hungry and everything. Uh how do you move forward? I really feel bad for the animals here. Oh. I grabbed on tight. But I was so hungry, I jumped out of the water. When I opened my eyes, everything had changed. A snake? Or is it an octopus? Am I gonna eat a human being? A sea a kraken? That's what I am now. Okay, where to next? Okay, the camera movement is actually in my control. Is it a toy? Yes, it is. That's so creepy, though. Not something I expect from a game like this. Is it back into Molly's room? Yes, it is. All my stomach started growling. Okay. 
So, Molly. I'm not sure if I believed all of that, but I'm sure Edie would have. And I guess uh, that's a good as spot as any for this to end this episode. So, with that, uh, yeah, I don't know what to expect with uh, what happened to Edith Finch. Because, uh, yeah, it's, it's like out there, like really out there for, for me right now. But, uh, yeah, it would be quite interesting to see. Like, you don't see, well, I don't see these kind of games that often. So, it would be quite interesting to see, like, uh, where it actually goes. So, with that, uh, I just want to thank you guys for watching. Uh, I'll be back really soon uh, with another episode. So, if this mystery has intrigued you as much as it has for me, I uh, hope you'll continue to join me with in this journey. And with that, I just want to thank you guys for watching. And uh, do remember, if you like what you see, uh, rem uh, please do like, share, or subscribe to the channel. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.